Hey guys, Redsome here, and today we're playing Dark Wolf 3. Now, I really like Dark Wolf 3 actually, and um, as some of you may already know that I actually played this on the channel a long time ago. And I actually tried to do this as well, but looking back on those videos, they were kinda bad. And I'm not really a huge fan of them, so I thought, you know, now that I know how to make videos a bit better and all that, I thought I'd redo this entire challenge of Dark Souls 3 with no weapons and no armor. So without much further talking, let's just immediately get into it. As for the name, it's gonna be... Rage and Rhythm. I like to think of it ironically, seeing as I never really get angry in video games. So, our character looks pretty good. Let's head on with the main game. Right, so here we are. Now, let me immediately just take everything off. No weapons, no armor. Rings are allowed and items are allowed. So I started with the life ring and I'm still allowed to use that, so that's all fine. Now, a big difference with before was the fact that I actually, uh, that I was using a mouse and keyboard, and now I'm actually using a controller. So it's gonna take some getting used to, but I'll be fine. I used to play a lot on a PS2, so, a uh, PS3, I mean, so it's not a huge difference. go. It's dashing, gotcha. Just move from here. Oh, hello. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now a good thing about using only your fist is the fact that they do very, they cost very little stamina. Meaning if I can just stagger someone, I can get some pretty good combos off. So all in all, that's pretty good. Oh, hello. Get around you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Perfect. I just keep moving, and the first bonfire should be around here. Okay, bonfire is lit. So far, so good. Haven't been hit once. Now then, just move from here. If I'm correct, the next boss should be to the left of here. Ah, crap. Not a great start, but okay. Everything is fine. It's all good. They won't actually follow me in here, so that's fine. Now all I gotta do is just remove this sword. And... Okay, that's parrying. Gotcha. One, two, three... One. Okay. Hey. All right. Okay, so it's gonna take some getting used to, but I should be fine, I hope. There we go. I haven't played this in a few months, so uh, we'll see how it goes. But I'm hoping I'll be fine. Okay, that, mo that should have been better timed. Just drink up. Boop, and dodge. Whew. Okay, not the perfect parry, I must admit. Okay, drink up again. Not a great start, but we'll be fine. There we go. Um, hmm. Okay. It's okay, I just didn't have to time all of this correctly now. And I can't get hit like even once, or this is this is GG. Don't worry though, I got this. Who needs HP, am I right? Oh, with that. <laughs> okay, I gotta get the parrying timing a bit down a bit better, but it'll be fine. All right, let's try it again. Excuse me, guys. Yep. Excuse me. Thank you. Okay, let's try this again. Hit. Oh, crap. There we go. Oof. Perfect. 
That's one. That's two. Just gotta get the timings down. That's what it's all about. That's three. That's four. A bit anxious, but I'm should be fine, I hope. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, that's not good. And just drink up. Crap. Perfect. Alright, yeah, I'm getting back in the swing of things. Missed me. Wow. Alright. Now you might be thinking this is going well, but halfway through, he is actually going to change shape. And then it becomes a bit more unpredictable. But he also falls into routine a lot, so it shouldn't be too hard, actually. It actually means I have to parry a lot less. Should be any moment now. Okay. Okay, here we go. Just keep punching. Roll. Punch. Roll. Punch. Roll. As you can see, not too hard. Nope. No. Oh. <laughs> that one's a bit more unpredictable. Okay, he's stunned. Let's just get some free hits in. Roll, roll. One, two. I don't like the fact that we're so close to the edge. But I might just roll off here. Just gonna, yeah. All right. There we go. <sighs> Nearly got off the edge there. Oh, roll. Ah, oh, crap. One, two. Okay. Drink up and roll. Oof. Perfect. Okay, he's stunned, meaning I can just get some free hits in. One, two, three, four. Okay, good, good. One, two. One, two, roll. Okay, perfect, he's stunned. Okay, roll away, to the side, and let's try this again. One, two, one, two, okay, one, two, roll away, <sighs> nearly fell off again, but I'm fine, stunned, one, two, come on. Okay. Roll away, nearly fell off the edge, but I'm fine. Okay, get away. One, two. One, two, three. No, oh, don't kick him. Come on. There we go. Whew. Bit of a tough one, but we did it. Alright. Bonfire is lit. Let's keep moving. There's a few more enemies here, but I'm just gonna avoid them. And just... Make my way in here. Put the sword in. Bonfire lit. And talk to this woman. Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. I'm a firekeeper. I tend to the flame, and tend to thee. The lords have left their thrones, and must be delivered to them. To this end, I am at thy side. Alright, let's all up. Very well. Then touch the darkness within me, take nourishment from thee. 
Okay, so one thing I want up is both my Vigor and my Endurance. Endurance is basically your stamina, Vigor is your health. Uh, vitality, is, I don't think it's needed because it just gets your carry weight up. Meaning, if you wear more heavier armor, you can still roll and be kind of agile in it. But seeing as I'm going to be completely naked throughout the entire game, this won't really be needed. Strength might be useful. I'm not sure how much it actually scales with bare fifths, but I guess we'll see. So yeah, this is good enough for now. Now, before I move on in this area, what I'm actually going to do is go back real quick. Now, in here... There should be one guy with a katana. And he's kind of a bitch to fight properly, because he can kick your ass really easily. Like, his weapon is really strong. But, I, but he gives you a lot of souls when you kill him, so if I can just actually get around to killing him, that would be great. Okay, preferably before he actually murders me. Just drink. Missed. Aha. Okay, now get to this side here. Just gonna wait for him to move towards me. That's right. Okay, now punch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. Perfect. Cool. Good, good, good. Now, if I actually come back here, he'll drop his katana. But there's no reason for me to actually uh, wait for that, seeing as I'm not going to use it anyway. I just want the extra fulls. And another ember. For those of you wondering, ember is... Um, if you look at the top left, you see that there's... After I killed that boss, you can see that the uh, symbol at the top left changed. Yeah, that's, that's basically what happens when you use an ember, you just get more HP, I think. It's kind of like humanity in the first Dark Souls, if you remember or played any of that. Now let's use that dead guy to level up again. Pretty. More endurance, more vigor. Life is good. Rest here. Travel to the highball of Lufric. Alright, so highwall of Lufric. Go, perfect. I'm just gonna quickly race my way through here because I don't really actually want to fight all these enemies and I kind of already know where to go. So let's see if I can just. Yep, just go down. Oh, excuse me. Go down from here. Oh, missed that ledge. Cost me a bit of HP, but it's fine. Just keep on moving. Just keep on moving. Hi, guys, don't mind me. Missed. Missed again. Oh crap. Oh, don't mind me. Just keep moving. Hi. Oh, missed again. Okay, now from here I go up. Run, 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 run. Ah, I can't light this bonfire because of the enemies. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Quickly move here. Okay, should be ready now. There we go. Bonfire is lit. Alright, next up I'm gonna pick, pick something up before I go to the next boss in this area. So if I can just... see. Go down from here. Through here. Down to here. Okay, just keep on moving, keep on moving. I think it was... let me see, was it over here? No, that fall would one, will 100% kill me if I try. Uh-huh. Right, I think it was actually... Yep, just excuse me, thank you. Is it somewhere around here? I... What if I just try... no, that, that, that would still kill me. Hmm. Oh wait, I see, I see. I think it was from here to here, and then into here. Yeah, this is all just based off of memory from things I did like a few months ago. So it won't be exactly accurate. Just bait him so that I can go through here. Perfect. Yes, yes, excuse me. Okay, it's over there. Gotcha. Yep, F the shard, that's exactly what I needed. Now then, just to make my way back now. Hi. Oh. 
You can't touch me, I'm too fast. Ow. Okay. Okay, can I actually make my way back up? Yes, I can. Just climb back up. Okay, this is all good. It's not a problem. All I need to do is just... Uh, up here? Yeah, it would... That definitely, I remember going up, so go up here. And back again to the bonfire. Just jump up, go from up here. All the way back. Okay, I can't use it because there's still those guys behind me, so if I just wait here again. Ah, crap. Are you actually telling me he's stuck? Fine, whatever, I'll take him out. Okay, he's no longer stuck. Meaning if I can just... Oh. Oh! Nice try. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, he has quite a lot of health, that's fine. If I can just... Oh! Okay, don't get hit. One, two, three, four, five. Oh crap. I accidentally pressed the parry button. Bit of a close one, but we're fine. Rest at the bonfire. I actually forgot to do one thing, so let me just return back to Firelink. Now, one thing I actually forgot to do here was the fact that if I go to this blacksmith... Well, a newcomer, I see. I am Andre. I serve at this shrine as a humble smith forging weapons. You're in search of the Lords of Cinder, I trust. A toilsome journey, I'd wager. You require good arms. I already have arms, thank Let you. Alright, now reinforced Estus flask with the Estus shard I picked up. Yes. Now I have four uses and stuff three. And furthermore. You can basically choose if you want it between your normal Estus Flask and your um, your mana Estus Flask, as it were. The thing is, I'm not using magic at all, so I'm gonna go into health. So now I have five. Now the souls I picked up just now, might as well use those to level up again. I'm not sure if it's enough. Yeah, it's enough for one level. Uh, endurance. Actually, no. You know what? Figure. Yeah. All right, it's done. Okay, just get down from here, I keep running. Now I'm just gonna make my way to the boss. I'm gonna try and do it without getting damaged, but if I get damaged I might as well try it anyway, seeing as I have a lot of health. Or maybe not, maybe I'll just actually go back, I'm not entirely sure yet. I guess we'll see. Okay, he misses. Son of a bitch, he hit me, but it's fine, it's only a little bit of damage. Not too worried about that, just keep moving. Okay, just run, 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 run. This area is actually quite dangerous, so I should be running. Yep, don't mind me. Hi. Ah, son of a bitch. Hi there. Ah, the wait has been long, unkindled one. I am Emma, High Priestess of Lothric Castle. Allow me to speak frankly. You will not find the Lords of Cinder here. They have left, gone, to their journey homes converging at the base of this castle. Head to the bottom of the High Wall. Forge on through the Great Gate and raise this banner to proceed. This farewell gift is for you. It is the insignia of an old covenant. If you fear trespassers, dark spirits drawn by the embers, then etch this upon your heart, and the old concord will beckon noble blue sentinels to hunt these foul spirits. Alrighty. 
Now that we've got that, we can head on to the next boss. Oh, missed. Missed again. Now just run past these guys. Hi, goodbye. I'm pretty sure they don't actually follow me in here. Just drink up a bit. And time for the next boss. The one that took me like, I don't know, a lot of hours the previous time. Ah, okay, Vord of the Boreal Valley. Now, this one, first stage, it's actually really easy. Just get up behind his legs and just pummel him. As you can see, like, even, even, I don't even have to roll sometimes, I can just walk under him. Just keep punching. Oh. So far, so good. Okay, actually... The camera is kind of a problem when I get stuck in a corner because it doesn't really know where to go sometimes when I'm right under him. But it's fine. Just gonna keep punching. As you can see, he doesn't really know what to do. Oh, just roll. One, two, three. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Actually, staggered him right now. Oh, crap. Like I said, the camera. One, two, three. One, two. The second stage, like, actually gets a lot harder, but we'll get there in a moment. Oop. Okay. I was hoping I could get through this without using Estus once, but I guess not. Well, at least this first half without using Estus once. The second half. Yeah, no chance. Oh, roll. Come on. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Don't like the fact that we're in a corner, but it's fine. Two, three, four, five, six. What's up? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. And roll. Four, five. Okay, that's the thing that tells me, hey, by the way, I'm in my second stage now. Okay, so he's gonna roll three times. One, two. I'll dash actually, not a roll. Okay, now he's gonna do that, which gives me a lot of time to actually get behind him and pummel his ass, literally. One, two, three, four, five. Avoid. One, two. Okay, now he's gonna go to the left. Still all good. And up. One, two, three. Up, oh, roll. Now the problem with that is when he does that, the problem that you have is he actually has a big AoE of damage. So if I don't roll and he does that attack where he actually like crashes his mace down, that might actually still hurt me. And in the second stage that does a lot of damage. Okay, so now he's dashing forward again. Those are pretty easy to avoid luckily. Okay. One, two, three. He's gonna get over here just in case that thing might hit me. Stamina back up. Roll. Oof. As you can see how much damage that did right there. Okay, and he has no chance of hitting me with that, so just drink up. Roll. Really gotta mind my rolls on this second stage. 
But I should be fine. Yep. Roll again. Up. Oh. My camera commentary, like, during games like Dunkful isn't the best, to be honest, seeing as I'm, like, really focusing on what I'm exactly doing. So it's kind of hard to properly tell you guys all the steps. Okay, so just get behind him again. It's all patterns, like, I just need to know what to do at a certain part, and then hope I'm doing it well enough. Rolled here, now he's gonna go to the left again. One, two... Oof, didn't really like that roll, but it went okay. Okay, just... Oof, not good. Okay, drink up. One, two, okay, now he's gonna dash forward again. One more time. He might actually do it the fourth time, but no. Sometimes he does it the fourth time and it really throws me off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up, oh, roll forward. Oof. One, two. Uh oh. Okay. What? Just drink up. There we go. That was my last Eftus, so I'm a bit cautious now. But we'll be fine. One, two. Roll. One, two. Forward. Okay. Ah, crap. Okay. One. Now. I actually forgot to... Uh, uh, I can't I can't use that seeing as I'm already with Ember. Okay. I was hoping on using it to top up my health once again, but no. Just gotta be careful then. Roll! Okay. Um. Come on. One. Two. Roll. That's not good. Okay, just get behind him. Ah, damn it, I didn't see it in time. Close one, though. Ah, too bad we didn't get it that, that time, but we can always try again. If you look at over there, uh, you can see that my health isn't as high as it was. So I'm just gonna use that ember just to make it as high again. There we go, Ember restored. Okay, just keep on moving. Let's try and get through this without actually getting hit once. And the annoying part is gonna come up. That's with those guys over that ladder that I need to go down from. So just hug the wall. He, miss his, he misses his shot. Roll at the right time, so he also misses his shot. Go down from here. Perfect, perfect. Now just keep moving, keep moving. Roll down. Still enemies behind me, so I need to be quick about this. And from here, I go down from here. Then down from here. Ah, son of a bitch. Oh, wait, actually, did, did that do any damage at all? Oh well. In any case, just get in here. Perfect. Now there's no cutscene this time, he just immediately gets right in front of you. So I just need to be careful. One, two, three. Oh, hi. Oh. Okay. One, two, three. One, two. One, two. Okay, the camera is kind of working against me seeing as we're in a corner, but it's good now. Okay, over here. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Oop. So like I said, first stage, not a problem.
and go over here. Uh oh. Okay, just. Oh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, oh. One, two, ah. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Okay, he's in a second stage now. It's a bit early, seeing as his ha health isn't halfway yet, but whatever. Oh, one, two, three. Good, good, good. Just get up behind him. Hummel. There we go. Roll. Just gonna get my stamina get back up. Now, I'm always trying to be mindful of my stamina. That's that's the main thing here. Because if your stamina is empty, I can't roll, nor can I attack. So I need to always take a good look at my stamina. Come on. Oh. Two, three. Roll. One. Two. Okay, I'm glad I staggered him there. Because I actually accidentally punched once too much and he would have hit me. Okay, one. Two, three, good, good, good. Okay, behind him again. One, two, three, four. Camera. Four, five, six, seven. Roll and roll. One, two, a roll. One, one, two, three. Not really, not really happy with that roll, but it went fine, luckily. Could have gone either way, really. Two. Yeah. Okay, I'm just trying to get out of that corner with him, because I can't actually see where he's gonna go half the time. That's too dangerous. Okay, so he's rolling all over the place again. One, two. Two, okay. So far, so good. And I'm just gonna pummel him again. Okay, close one, but we're fine. Oh, roll to the side. One, two. One, two. One, two. Oh. It's all patterned. There's no difference between Dunk Full 3 and Dance Dance Revolution. It's all about patterns. Oh, I can't see what's going on. Okay. Alright, that was kind of the camera screwing me over, but it's fine. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pull to the side. One, two, up. One, up. Okay. One, two, three. Uh oh. One, two, Three. Okay. I need to be careful here. Okay, drink now. Good, good, good. Uh oh. Not sure what he was doing there, but okay. Okay, he's gonna roll now. The, I keep calling it rolling, but he's not really rolling, is he? He's just dashing. Okay. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Roll. Up, oh, roll. Whew. Okay, one, two. Roll again. You just keep rolling in between his legs or just near his legs. He doesn't know what to do. I just need to roll at the exact time as his mace goes down, otherwise, it will damage me. Wait for my stamina to fill up again. One. 
Okay, now he's gonna dash again. When he does that, like, that little back step, that's when he's gonna wanna dash. So I just... If I'm just mindful of that, I should be fine. Two, three, four... Six, seven, eight, nine... Ten... Seven... Okay... One, two, three... Come on, one more punch and I should be fine. One... <sighs> Perfect. From those ba two monsters taking me 50 hours, going all the way to 40 minutes. <laughs> Perfect. So finally, the next area. Gorgeous view. Yeah, you're not wrong. Actually looks really nice. That's something Dark Souls has always done really well. Okay, let's keep on moving. Raise the banner. All right, new area, perfect. Now, seeing as we just beat the first two bosses and actually progressed through to the third area, I think we should call it a part here. Next time, we're actually going to continue on with Dark Souls 3. And um, I'm pretty sure there's a ring here, like someone else pointed me to it. It would be really handy for me to pick up, so I'll be sure to see if we can do that as well. And progress on to the third boss. For now, I just want to say thank you all for watching. This has been Dark Souls 3, no weapons, no armor. And I'll see you all next time.